More than 40 teen delegates gathered at the Oveda Culp Hobby Soldier and Family Readiness Center to pinpoint three main issues to present at this year's annual Army Family Action Plan Conference. They're going to discuss those issues and prioritize the ones that they think are most important and formulate recommendations for making change and improving those issues for them. Maintaining a good Army standard of living is what AFAP is all about. Having more things to do for the teenagers, because there's a lot of stuff to do for the little kids and stuff. Get teens together, maybe bonfires, stuff like that. These military teens aged 13 to 19 brainstorm for two days. They want to make sure their voices are heard and that things change for the better. The moving and stuff, it gets hard and trans, like, I can see how they let people move when kids are in elementary or maybe seventh grade or anything, but high school, I don't think the Army should allow people to transfer to another duty station when their kid is in high school. Because it's, you miss out a lot when you're switching high schools. I know people who have gone to like five different high schools and that doesn't make sense to me. Like some of the trips, we went to Houston we said it like the bus ride was longer than we were there. We were there for two hours and the bus ride total was like eight hours. And I was like, trips, they aren't like, wow, they're just museums, some uh, water parks, but they're not like, wow. Baseball games, I mean, there's some games in Austin that won't be that far. They, won't, they aren't four hour drives. Proof that the AFAP process works Army-wide is the implementation of youth career fairs here at Fort Hood and the brand new skate park. At the conclusion of the event, the delegates decided on an improvement of technology and education. The inclusion of a Fort Hood app for smartphones and mobile devices was suggested, and a teen resiliency training program. Also, a class on mastering stress for teens. Reporting from Fort Hood, Texas, I'm Angie Malone.